Welcome to our class of Algebra 2. Today is Algebra 2. <coughs> our topic is an evaluated rational exponent. Okay. Uh, our first problem is simplify negative 32 to the one fifth power exponent. Okay. Before, let me explain some ideas <coughs> to uh, we that we have to remember. If in this case a <clears throat> like a variable is a positive 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 real number <coughs> and a a is an eight in talking away an integer integer uh with uh n greater than 1 so then we are going to have here uh, we will have a uh, a to the 1 n power so this is equals <coughs> a to the m radical n okay square to square uh, an n so any number <coughs> This is one point. Another point uh, to review the same identity is also um, true if A is a negative. Okay, and then is uh, yeah, and then is all. Yeah, this is another um, point. However, if a is negative, is negative, and n is even, then uh, we are, we will have um, a to the one over n in power and n i mean a square not square radical n to the uh, of a do not exist so the symbol here the symbol and the symbol um It's like this. It's called radical. All right. It's called radical. So another another ideas um, when we talk working in this class in this class um, if uh, if n is equal to the radical is a square. Is a square. Okay, so if none exists, um, and, uh, is not um the two is not is a square. It's a square. Um. I mean the, the two is not written, it's not written, so the radical is, is like this. Right? So some some ideas that are very important uh, keeping your mind before to work with, with radicals when exponent uh, radical exponents. So our problem here is a right exponential as could be right the exponent. Using radical, using radical and simplify, and simplify. All right. Our problem is uh, is this one. Then uh, the first step. So write the number negative two to the one fifth power. So it's a C cos. Uh, let's use another color, right, right, 
5 right there, so negative 2 right here. So this is since it's ones, you simplify. So the answer is uh, here is 2. Yeah, negative 2. So that's, that's our answer, okay? This is a solution for this problem. Okay, let's try to solve another one. Let me show another problem. Uh, let's write um, problem number two. Simplify. Simplify a to the negative one third. Okay. So write the problem. So eight to the negative one third. Uh, how some? Um, let me write solve here. It should be well uh, equals eight. Let's write negative one on top and then in the bar of three. So next step uh, here, uh, make the radical. This is the number eight right here, and then here, what is the number? Three, right? Three. Let's write three. Three. Then since it's negative. And number this right here is negative one, right? Then a next step is uh, this is equals two, two to the negative one exponent. Okay. Then uh, you simplify this. Will be uh, one on top, and then two to the one and the barrel, right? So this is um, maybe right using identity. Which one? B. Uh, let me write the color. Let's write B, B right here. B to the to the negative C. This is equals uh, right here is one on top and the bottom B C. Uh, this is the rule right there. Then, um, what is the answer here? Should be equals. Um, we are here. So, on two, the answer is one. Right here is one half the answer. Okay. This is the, the, the our conclusion. One, uh, one, two. All right. Uh, let's do another one. It's, it's, it's very easy. It's fine. Um, simplify. Let's simplify. Um, problem number three. Let's find um, 16. Let's write 16 to the 1 4 power. Okay. So then 16 to the 1 4 power. This is equals. Um, The radical is 16 inside, and then number four right here. So it's one is one, positive one, and then 16 is square and not square. Four uh, to the 16 radical is equals two. Yeah, two by two by two by two. Yeah, 16. Okay. This is our answer. Okay, our solution is done.